All right, it's another fun 10-minute ornament from Sunshine Discount Crafts, sunshinecrafts.com, for all your great creative ideas. We are going to make this quick, simple ornament. This is my granddaughter's name, so everybody has a granddaughter that, <laughs> or a daughter that they want to put on their ornament. And this is very quick. It's going to take us a few minutes. We're taking a PET ornament, which is a non-breakable um, plastic ornament. You could also use glass but we're using this because it's easier. You don't have to worry about it breaking or anything. We're going to take the glitter it glue and it's just a very light liquid. You put squirt some in your ornament and you're going to swirl it around so that you cover all the areas. I just start and just go around, go around, go around. And once you do all this, you're just going to spill the extra out of the ornament. Um, it just sticks all over there and you're going to spill the extra out. Make sure I get it all covered. I was going to spill it into the... Uh, you can put I'm it back in the glitter. This little cap. Okay, so we spilled that out. Now we're going to make a little funnel here so we can get some red glitter and we're going to put some of the red glitter down and you could use any kind of glitter if you want to use an iridescent, purple, whatever your favorite color, a team color, um, whatever you choose. Glitter is one of those things that, as you can see, I got a little leak in my funnel. Um, glitter is one of those things that um, no matter where you use it or how much you use, you always, it's a staticky thing. So once I use glitter, I'm going to be sparkly. Um, sparkly, sparkly all day. So look how quick this is all covering this ball. Now I know a lot of you have probably seen the, how they use the glitter paints inside of these ornaments and everything, but this product makes it quick because you don't really have a lot of drying time. You could it's like wash and wear. You know, it's quick. Just cover it and you're all set. If I have a little spot there that I can't get the glitter on, I can fix that. Okay, so that's all on there. And then you could just dump out your excess glitter so you can still use it. And I sometimes I just use a paper plate and dump it out on a paper plate, scoop it back up, you can put it back in the glitter container so you don't have to waste anything. Then I'm going to find the cap and I can put the cap back on. And now I'm going to put the name on. And I'm using, you could hand put write this with a glitter pen and everything but if you want to cheat you can get one of these little pre-done letters these are actually about 3 8 inch this is a small letter um, and we're just going to peel them off and stick them when you peel these off you want to be super careful because they will come apart. They can come apart and they will come apart. You can shift them around a little bit. Got a J on there. Um, there these ones are little pearls. Um, depending on where you get your letters, what you use. Um, some of you people have scrap, do a lot of scrapbooking, so you may already have some kind of stick on letter. And you just have to be very careful peeling them off because you can peel off part of your letter, like part of your pearl, like somebody did with my M.
you could also use these do these for a teacher's gift if you wanted to do it with the teacher's name on it or something personal or a personal message or you could do um, if you wanted to do like live, laugh, love and you wanted to do different ornaments or anything special, a special word, a, a secret um, nickname and that's it. You just put them on and it's all ready to hang. So shop at sunshinecrafts.com for all the great project ideas and crafts.